This is the steamship Robin, the last of its kind, after carrying goods from all over the world, from Victorian times. After being rescued from Portugal in the 1970s and restored to the place where she was built, her vast cargo hold has been empty for many years. But soon she will be housing a magical object, a large circular shield, the Shield of Achilles. This has been made by Dominique Pinci, once the owner of a famous French bookshop in Venice. When, sadly, the shop had to close, Dominique was able to fulfil an ambition and spend two years constructing a seven-metre diameter shield of Achilles using paper mache made from printed materials. On it are a hundred enchanting characters and seventy animals, all reflecting Homer's description of an ideal society. The shield is an important part of the ancient poet Homer's story called the Iliad. Before the days of reading, writing and theatres, for nearly a thousand years people all over the Mediterranean sang the poem to each other to preserve the story of the gruesome ten-year Trojan War. The gods made the shield for the great warrior Achilles' last battle. It was an astounding thing. It shone brighter than the sun. No one was strong enough to carry it alone except Achilles. It was covered in images and symbols of essential things which ensure future harmonious society. Agriculture, justice, dancing, plus the moon, stars and the ocean. It was a metaphorical reminder of how society could find a way after a period of turmoil. The position of symbols was particularly important. It is thought that the sung poem was also an early verbal map used by sailors to remember the position of stars and navigate their way across the seas. Dominique's Shield of Achilles was exhibited in Venice, then brought, firstly by water, to London. Now all its pieces lie waiting in the hold of the veteran steamship, ready to be assembled and shared with all its nearby neighbours, and then the world. The shield and its purposes were reimagined by some of S.S. Robin's neighbouring schoolchildren, who shared Dominique's studio and ideas, and a creative journey that, although harshly interrupted, sowed seeds of hope for a better future. As bright as the snow, as dark as the sea, from the sea to the sand, to the dead full factories that send smoke by the stars twinkle no matter what, the sky stands up and never takes a break, the earth spins round and round and round. The more we destroy, the more it destroys us.